How's it going YouTube? Sorry I've not uploaded a video in quite a while, but can't do much about that. It's all in the past. Um this is a video on the Hubson H one oh seven D X four FPV quadcopter. Uh, for those of you who don't know, a quadcopter is just basically a helicopter except it's got four sets of propellers instead of one. Uh yeah, it's very, very small. I'd probably guess it's only like three inches wide not no not three inches bigger than that uh yeah i'm just measuring it now it's about five inches squared and across the four it is six just over six inches um yeah it's a great little toy to use um very fun to mess around with it does come with uh, uh, another set of propellers in case if you lose any I myself have lost one of them I'm quite actually lucky that it didn't land in the stream and well destroy itself or anything um, it does have a removable battery I've not removed it yet because well I don't think it's exactly necessary but it does have a very short battery life which could lead to you carrying several sets of well several battery packs around with you because why well, I'm thinking of just putting a battery pack on top so it gives it a extended battery life the remote the remote is quite big it's six and a half inches wide and seven and a half inches tall it does have a screen as it obviously it's FPV which is first person view so it means you can like fly it and it will have a live feed of what the quadcopter is videoing and you can record it like well obviously I'm recording it right now for the video on the right side of the remote it does have a micro SD card slot so you can record stuff and the micro USB for software updates but it does say in the manual don't do that ever at a first look it is very complicated as it has well it's got a lot of buttons I don't even know how much uh, yeah it's got two analog sticks for height well the one on the left is to control how height goes and to rotate it left and right the right analog stick is to make it go forwards left right and backwards there are four sort of up and down left and right switches which can toggle the effect of how much it goes to the left or right so say if it's going too much to the left when you're not telling it to you can adjust that so it stays completely still in midair it does have an expert mode which is activated by just pressing down on the right analog stick which means you can control it to much higher speeds like I was just oh well I was, had it in expert mode then and crashed so I'd advise having it in uh, normal mode there is a flip function which is activated by holding down on the left toggle switch yeah it, if you press and hold the down button it will say flip on or flip off this means you can do like front flips or back flips or side flips yeah and if you press down on the left analog stick it will turn the LEDs off because it does have LEDs on all propellers and one in the middle so if you do lose it like I do in this video later on you can find it but it's a uh, it has a white frame so in the snow that's not really very useful it does have flashing red and blue lights which are very good but as I say if it's landed in the snow like it's just about to you're pretty much screwed if it lands upside down and well the first person view cam is very useful as without it I probably would have lost it that day but it is very good uh, well it makes it very useful to find 
so say like now I couldn't have found it but seeing as I had the first person view I just kept walking around and here I am I just found myself and then I found the quadcopter um the remote takes up four AA batteries and it does tear them up qu pretty quickly uh, uh well as it's got to show a constant LCD screen view sorry LED um yeah that probably might suggest why the quadcopter has quite a small battery life it only lasts around 10 minutes probably because it has to record and stream live video footage but takes quite a while to charge as you can see in these bits here it just as it did there it goes very wobbly uh, this is due to the battery running out and it does this quite a lot and I think it does it over here again but yeah ju just bring it back to you and if it has flashing lights on it that means it is running out of battery yeah I hope you enjoyed this video please like and subscribe and post in your comments what do you think I should do next